Well, Happy New Year. Hope this turns out to be a great year for everybody. We're anticipating a good one, so keep a good thought on that. So this morning we're down here with our New Year's puppies. This is Aspen's litter, and they were born uh, yesterday and actually started on Saturday night and finished on Sunday morning. So she's got seven puppies, and I kind of split them up between boys and girls. These are the boys. These are the girls. Um, they're not microchipped. We're just doing a quick video down here to show you these guys, and they're going back to mom. Um, we'll do a video later on, probably, uh, probably sometime, maybe over the weekend. We'll do another one, maybe Saturday or Sunday, because Vanessa will be in here this weekend. So I'm going to start with the boys, and we're going to go down. So they'll probably get all squatched up here in a minute. So this is a, a male. This is a chocolate party, and he's got brown on the tip of his tail. So when we dock his tail, he's going to have a brown spot on the tail, brown on the back. He's got really pretty markings on the head. He will have a brown nose and nice big fat puppy. Most of these guys, the bigger ones in here, were almost seven ounces when they were born. I know, but turn around here and you'll be fine. Um, this puppy is a phantom. I don't know if it's going to stay holding the phantom. It has phantom under the tail, that's for sure. But it also looks like the body's going to change colors. But it's got the phantom markings on the legs. Up the back of the legs are phantom markings. It's got the phantom markings on the face. Brown under the ears. This is a good one to show you. Ears are sealed completely shut. Eyes and ears are shut at birth and sealed. They will not open until between 11 and 15 days old. Um, let me roll him over here. He has huge white tuxedo chest. He's got white on the back toes and white on the front toes. So that'll give you a picture of his back also. And this puppy, I did not roll it over for you, but the white puppy that was first, it's all white under its belly. This is a beautiful, beautiful chocolate merle. Oh, I love the chocolate merles. That's thanks to Turbo 2. And he is gorgeous. He's got beautiful markings on his back. I love this white sock on the front. Looks like somebody dipped his foot in it. And these guys have big feet. Um, big toes on this side looks great. He's got big, not big toes. He has white toes. They still have the dew claw, which is this dew claw on the right here. Um, if Vanessa can zoom in on that, you can see that extra toe. That's called the dew claw. That will be taken off when the tail's in. Um, Tails are done, we do dew claws at the same time, and they'll be microchipped at that time. The backs have no dew claws. It's gonna have a dark, dark spot on the tail with probably not very much brown. There will be brown on the bottom, but he's a gorgeous puppy. All right, that's the boys, let's hit the girls. Boy, your toenails are almost ready to need done, goodness. This is a black and white party. And she is, she's got some black and white spots on her rear end. She's got it here, here, and here. Oh, that's kind of cool. I don't know what that looks like, but she's going to have a short tail. Uh, well, shot short. It's going to be about that long. So she's going to keep her black dots. She's got a dot on this side. She's got a dot on her, a domino dot on her head. And whoop, see you jumped. And she's got really pretty markings on her face. She's got black around both eyes. And she's all white on her belly. Okay. And what you see is pink on her face. Her nose will turn black and this pink cheeks will turn white. I know. I'm going to lay you down. All right. This one is a blue merle party. No, you're not. Yeah, you are. You are tough to tell. Yeah, you're blue. She's got a really pretty blue merle face. She also has blue merle spots on her side. She's going to have a blue merle tail when it's docked. And she's got the domino dot on top of her head. And she's going to have a black nose. What you see is pink around her mouth will turn white. You guys are all spinning the other way. Turn that way. Uh, and she's got a black spot on this side. Belly is probably all white. I'm 99% sure it is. I know, I know, I know. All right. This is the black female. But... We think it's going to turn phantom. And you still got some belly button hanging there. Yep, I'm not going to pull on it, that's for sure. 
So that's a phantom tail. If you can zoom in and, and Vanel explain the phantom, she's gonna have this dark under her, or light under her tail, which means she can turn phantom just like her mom. So these legs may turn phantom as she gets a little bit older. Uh, they may not, I can't tell yet, but she does have the phantom marking under her tail. Now, that could also indicate she's gonna change colors. But we won't know that until, um, you're just gonna to go to sleep in my hand and stay there. Maybe about three or four weeks if we look on this belly, because if they're gonna change colors, they usually start down here on their belly. Right now she's ebony black. And she has no white anywhere on her chest. Can I pull your head up this way? There's no white on the chest. But that's kind of odd with that, below, that, that phantom marking under the tail. So if she does turn phantom, Aspen is a phantom, but she didn't turn for a long time. And if this one turns, she'll have the brown eyebrows, brown in her ears, and her ears are, everybody's ears are sealed shut. Um, so I can't tell you. I don't know if she's gonna stay black or turn phantom, so time will tell. All right, the last one in the bunch is having dreams. She's moving around. Let me roll you over here so you don't wake up. This little girl is a, oh, she says stretch. This little girl is a blue merle party. She's also getting some blue merle spots, oops, on her uh, chin. She's got a beautiful, beautiful mask with a white spot in her head. Um, I don't see any brown in those ears, so I don't think she's going to be a uh, try. She's got lots of blue merle spots on her back. She's going to have a blue merle tail when it's docked. And her belly is totally white. We're just going to roll you all around here, Tootsie. So that's just a quick video of these guys. I will take pictures. Um, like I said, probably um, over the weekend, I will. Well, I guess I didn't tell you on this. I haven't done any pictures yet. I won't do pictures until Tails and Dewclaws. I won't do tails and dew claws until they're four days old. So um, later in the week when I do tails and dew claws, I will take their first baby pictures and uh, we'll put it on the website. Uh, I'll probably take pictures with their tails on. As soon as I take the picture, we'll dock the tail, we'll microchip them, we'll take the dew claws off and we'll give them a toenail trim. Uh, mothers greatly appreciate, I don't take the backs off because the backs let them dig into the floor and push themselves forward into mom. But the front ones, they use their feet when they nurse back and forth and it scratches their mom's bellies. So we usually try and keep those front toes short when they're babies, but they're all doing great. Um, we'll do weights on them also when we put pictures on and on the next video we'll weigh them for you, but I didn't wanna keep them down here that long. So I guess we're butt, butt, butt. Let me see if I can turn faces where everybody's gonna probably wake up and just crawl all over anyway. Turn around here and Vanessa can do one more zoom down there for faces, maybe. They never usually cooperate at this age. They just kind of go all over the place like little worms. All right, have a great week. Have a great new year. And um, please don't call me. So what's gonna happen is once I post the individual photos, the pics of this litter are given in the order that is on that waiting list. If you are seeing this on YouTube, Please do not call me because there is a ton of people waiting on these puppies if someone doesn't take one. Um, you know, right now with COVID, there's so many people looking for a puppy that I apologize. We, I'm just not taking any more names at this time. So the list, I'll call you when it's your turn to pick a puppy. Um, I will text everybody when I put uh, the pictures on. But today, um, yeah, I'll probably text you today too. If you subscribe to my YouTube page, once you go to my YouTube page, hit subscribe. Every time I put a video on, I don't text everybody because I don't have time. But if you subscribe to my YouTube channel, it will email you that there is a new video on. And when it does that, it will not only be on YouTube, but it will be on my, my, my uh, website. So that's the best way to keep in touch with when I put on videos. You are always welcome to call me or text me with questions. Please don't email me. I'm so far behind on emails. If you are on my email list and you're waiting on me to email you, I'm so sorry. But just text me or call me. It's the best way to get a hold of me. So have a great week. Make it a blessed one. Stay safe. And we'll talk to you later.